SpaceX has just achieved a milestone that other rocket companies can only dream of. Years of innovation and hard work have finally paid off as the company has solidified its place as the most reliable and cost-effective mode of orbital transportation. Let's talk about this incredible milestone, how SpaceX continues to push the limits of its rockets and what the future holds. SpaceX continues to set new records in the field of modern aerospace technology, showcasing its leadership in the industry. Recently, the company achieved a remarkable milestone by reusing a Falcon 9 first stage for an unprecedented 17th time. At first glance, this might seem like a minor accomplishment, but it becomes truly mind-boggling when you realize that this single booster has traveled to space and back 17 times. The Falcon 9's reusability achievement is just one part of a larger picture. In 2023 alone, SpaceX has launched 70 rockets, including 66 Falcon 9S, 3 Falcon Heavies, and 1 Starship. The company's ambitious goal is to increase this number to 100 launches by the end of the year. Achieving this target would require maintaining a rapid launch cadence, with a rocket taking to the skies every three to four days. The launch frequency witnessed this year builds upon SpaceX's remarkable performance in 2022. In the previous year, the Falcon 9 rocket achieved an extraordinary feat by completing 60 launches within a single calendar year. This accomplishment was monumental for various reasons, particularly because it shattered a record that had endured for over four decades. The previous record set by the Soyuz rocket in 1979 stood at 47 launches, 45 of which were successful. SpaceX not only broke this long-standing record, but also significantly surpassed it. This achievement marked yet another significant milestone in their ever-expanding list of accomplishments. What adds even more significance to this achievement is the fact that SpaceX has maintained a flawless safety record over its last 228 launches, dating back to September 2016. This impeccable track record isn't just a source of pride. It represents a strategic advantage when it comes to securing new contracts. Whether these contracts are from nations looking to advance scientific exploration or companies aiming to deploy satellite constellations, having a reliable launch provider is of utmost importance. SpaceX's commitment to reliability and innovation has not only earned them the trust of long-standing customers, but has also led to the redirection of clients from veteran aerospace companies such as Boeing and Russia's Roscosmos. This competitive edge, coupled with its consistent track record of success, has catapulted SpaceX to the forefront of this year's list of the most successful companies in the space industry. SpaceX's ascent to industry leadership in just two decades, breaking into a field historically dominated by established giants and government agencies, is nothing short of astonishing. While companies like Boeing have a legacy spanning over a century in the aerospace business, SpaceX, a relative newcomer, not only caught up but also managed to surpass them. Elon Musk, SpaceX's visionary leader, shows no signs of slowing down, he has made it abundantly clear that the company's mission is to continually increase the frequency of its launches. Musk envisions a future where SpaceX conducts as many as 10 Falcon flights per month by the end of this year, with even grander plans for the future. Recently, SpaceX's Falcon 9 took off from Cape Canaveral Space Force Station in Florida, successfully transporting 22 of SpaceX's Starlink Internet satellites into low Earth orbit. What makes this feat even more remarkable is the fact that the Falcon 9's first stage returned to Earth a mere eight and a half minutes after launch, gracefully landing on a SpaceX drone ship at sea. This marked the 17th successful landing of the Falcon 9 booster, which took its inaugural flight in June 2020. Serving as a reliable workhorse for SpaceX, this particular Falcon 9 booster has been instrumental in numerous significant missions, including 11 Starlink delivery flights. The ability to reuse rocket components has proven to be a game changer for the aerospace industry. Recently, the company's vice president discussed SpaceX's objective to certify Falcon 9 boosters for up to 20 missions. Achieving this goal would have substantial financial implications. To put it into perspective, reusability stands to save tens of millions of dollars per launch. In stark contrast, traditional expendable rockets, which are constructed anew for each mission, can cost upwards of $60 million. By embracing reusability and recycling components, SpaceX can significantly reduce manufacturing and material costs, ushering in a new era of cost-effective space exploration. The financial savings become even more astounding when you consider that SpaceX has maintained a 100% success rate for the past 228 launches since September 2016. Just imagine the additional costs incurred in the case of failures, both in terms of financial losses and setbacks to scheduled missions, if SpaceX were using expendable rockets. If a Falcon 9 first stage can indeed be reused for up to 20 missions, as the company hopes, this could represent potential savings of hundreds of millions of dollars for the first stage of the rocket alone. This calculation doesn't even account for the potential reusability of other components, such as the Dragon spacecraft, which has also been ingeniously designed for multiple missions. 
SpaceX's ventures extend far beyond the confines of the Falcon 9. There's substantial excitement surrounding their other rockets, notably the Starship and Falcon Heavy. Starship in particular has been a focal point of both enthusiasm and regulatory scrutiny. Preparations for its second launch were in full swing, initially scheduled between September 8th and 13th. However, it encountered a setback when the Federal Aviation Administration, FAA, denied SpaceX the necessary launch license. The FAA specified that SpaceX must complete 63 corrective actions to secure the license. Despite this hurdle, as of this week, the Starship rocket has once again been fully assembled at Starbase. Anticipation is high for a critical milestone in the future, a full-stack wet dress rehearsal. During this rehearsal, prototypes will be loaded with approximately 5,000 tons of liquid oxygen and methane propellant. This test will involve a launch countdown, aborting just before ignition and liftoff. A wet dress rehearsal is meticulously designed to replicate a launch attempt, allowing SpaceX to assess operations and refine processes. The gathered data provides a robust indication of readiness for launch, which has always been a highlight for spectators. If the rehearsal concludes without substantial issues, SpaceX plans to ignite all 33 of the Raptor engines installed on the Super Heavy Booster 9 simultaneously. However, the path to success is filled with uncertainties and challenges. Before a debut orbital launch can occur, several components and protocols must be verified and validated. This includes interim static fires with fewer engines and another short destacking process to arm the flight termination system, typically done very close to the actual launch date. The design concept of Starship and Mechazilla deviates significantly from conventional rockets, allowing for multiple easy stackings and destackings. Mechazilla, with its remarkable resistance to winds, serves as a commendable substitute for the immense cranes traditionally required to stack Starship atop Super Heavy. This innovation is particularly crucial in regions like the Gulf of Mexico, where storms and high winds are frequent occurrences. SpaceX further fueled the excitement with a recent tweet stating, Starship stacked at Starbase ahead of flight. Team continues to work with the FAA on a launch license. This development hints that we might be on the cusp of witnessing this historic launch after all. In addition to the Starship, SpaceX is gearing up for another significant launch involving the Falcon Heavy, currently the second most powerful rocket in operation. This launch is slated to take place in the coming weeks. The Falcon Heavy will carry NASA's Psyche spacecraft on a mission to study a metallic object in the main asteroid belt between Mars and Jupiter. Originally scheduled for 2022, this mission has generated substantial scientific interest. The spacecraft's objective is to provide unprecedented data on the asteroid Psyche, holding the potential to unlock a treasure trove of information for scientists and space enthusiasts alike. SpaceX's missions, which encompass both scientific and commercial objectives, exemplify the multifaceted approach the company has taken to ensure the comprehensive development of space technology. Do you think the Starship will achieve the same level of reusability as the Falcon 9? Please share your thoughts in the comments below.